Hey, what's up everybody? If you've ever done compositing in Photoshop, you know how hard it can be to get everything to look realistic, to get the shadows right, to get the lighting right, to make the scene look like it was really taken all as one picture as opposed to you adding multiple layers together. Well, that just got a lot easier thanks to the new Harmonize feature in the latest Photoshop public beta. Let's take a look. So I've got uh, the street scene open here. This is an Adobe stock image. And what I love to do is just drop this runner in that's tying their shoes or getting ready for their run. And we'll back them up because you know we're missing part of their butt there. And we'll back them up onto the scene. And uh, once I get them in place, the next thing I wanna do is remove the background. And you know, you might think, oh, okay, I'm done, that's it. Uh, no, you're not done. <laughs> that does not look realistic at all. Number one, it looks like the person is kind of floating above the street. And number two, they're probably too big. That's, that's a whole different issue. But number three is the lighting. This looks like, you know, it's mid morning or evening. And this is broad daylight, middle of the day. So first and foremost, let's, uh, let's, let's try and make the, um, there we go. Let's try and make the scene a little bit more realistic we'll drop the size down a bit there we go kind of drop them in place right there and again they're just floating in midair they're just the just doesn't look right so we're going to go ahead and do the one thing i've been waiting for since the sneak at adobe max last year and that is this one click harmonize button so we've got our new layer selected we click harmonize and we give it a few seconds to cook what this will do is generate a new composite layer and it will also give us three variations to choose from. It will adjust the shadows and lighting to make this look all like it was taken together. Let's give it a second to work. And oh my God, so much better. So number one, shadows, because that makes it seem look like it was, the actual guy was actually right there. Number two, look at the lighting difference. And again, we get three variations to choose from. So there's one, there's two, and there's three. So you could pick the one you like best, I don't know, I kind of like two the best probably because it's just a little bit darker. And that, that would be my favorite scene. If I didn't like it, I could just generate three new ones. But there it is, my new composite layer. And just in case you forgot how bad it used to look because we get used to things that look good pretty quickly. There's before, <laughs> totally fake, totally dropped in, totally fit, floating in midair, no shadows, the lighting's wrong. And there's number two where it actually looks like it could have been there. Size and proportions are probably still a little bit off, but that's, those are adjustments you can make, of course, to get it just right. But here we go in terms of just harmonizing the scene to make it look better, quickly and easily, as opposed to you spending minutes or hours to just adjust the lighting and the shadows to get it to look right. So that's the new Harmonize feature available today, starting today in the Photoshop public beta. You can go to your Creative Cloud app and download it today. Cheers, everyone. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you on the next one.